Beijing is a modern city with ancient roots. Yet in the midst of its hustle and bustle, you could slip down a side alley and find a world of peace and quiet. As well as many Beijing families still living in these quadrangle courtyard houses, could see her Yuan. These alleyways outside the courtyards are called hutongs. They connect neighborhoods and communities together and form a harmonious living environment. In the summertime, neighbors drink chilled tea, play chess, and chat in the shade under the trees. All Beijingers say these moments are most pleasant indeed. The quadrangle walls surround the houses and form the courtyard. Sitting north and facing south, the courtyard is shaped like the Chinese character for mouth. The courtyards are shielded by grey brick walls, so people on the outside could not peek in. To reach the inner courtyard, you must go through the front gate on the southeast corner and around the screen wall. The outer courtyard is a place for receiving visitors. The Chuihua gate separates the two sections. Trees and flowers are planted in the courtyards, attracting many birds. It's a world in itself. The main rooms for the elders face south. Three or four generations live together in the courtyard, and they all have their own rooms. This living arrangement is very convenient. Lang Jinyuan is a residence with a front and backyard and San Jinyuan is a residence with a front, a middle and a backyard. These quadrangle courtyards are the ideal home arrangement for old Beijing families. Wang Jinghu leads a very busy life. This courtyard house was left by his great-grandfather, Wang Fengqing. It was built over a hundred years ago. Wang Jinghu was born in this quadrangle courtyard. Now he goes back to his old house every week to clean up the house and plant flowers. Qin Su Yan was born in the UK. His maternal grandparents once lived in the quadrangle courtyard. When he returned to the land of his ancestors, he was fascinated by the old courtyards. Here, he has recorded the sounds of the street vendors peddling goods in the hutongs, as a way to preserve the memories of life in old Beijing. This hutong museum stores the history of the Soho Yuan courtyards. Many Chinese dwellings have similar harmonious structures. They reflect China's traditional family etiquette. During the Yuan, Ming and Qing dynasties, the quadrangle courtyard gradually became the basic style of residence in Beijing. Whether large or small, Suho Yuan was the style of residence for royals, nobles and commoners alike across the capital. These courtyards are extensions of the traditional Chinese family space. As a classic symbol of a Chinese home, as time passes, only the concept of harmony will last, and it is deeply engraved in the heart of every Chinese.